Hey, how's it going guys? It's Andrew and today I'm going to be showing you how to add a password, pattern, or pin lock to any app on your HTC One with protected apps and exposed. Now because this is an exposed module, you, got, you are going to need to have root permission on your device and have exposed and ready installed. After that, go ahead and open it up. You'll go to download, search for protected apps. After you find that, scroll over, tap install, install it. And now after it's done installing, tap done, go back, and reboot your device. Alright, so now that you're restarted, protected apps would already be up and running. You will have only five apps to add a passcode to. If you want to have unlimited apps, you will have to donate to the developer. The donate package is $3.41, which can be purchased directly from the app itself. From the settings of protected apps, you have the option to select um, if the app will have an icon in your launcher or not. You could always activate it from exposed if you disable the icon from your launcher. You could also disable the app completely, say if you forget the password or pattern or pin or anything, so that you don't have to worry about entering that in every time you want to open up an app that's protected. Protected apps does come with an always on notification, but you could always disable that from the notification section of the settings. You would also have the option to show a toast little pop-up on the bottom whenever you unlock or lock an app. Okay, for some reason, on Sense devices, you're only able to set up a, the password to be the same one that you have that's locking your phone. So if you have a pattern on your lock screen, you can only set up as a pattern through protected apps. I have run this on CyanogenMod, mod, and you are able to select individual passwords and patterns for both lock screen and protected apps but on sense for some reason those two are tied together. If you have an app locked in protected apps it will not stop it from being uninstalled. If you want to block uninstallation of any apps all you have to do is add a passcode to package installer and that will stop it from installing or uninstalling apps on your device. Alright guys, we're going to wrap it up for this video. Be sure to check out the full guide linked in the description below for the full breakdown of protected apps. And like always, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Have a good one, guys.